To me, there's just something magical about Black Mesa. I'm kind of a rock hound, so I love all the in-your-face geology, the rainbow layers of rock everywhere, remnants of a time before this landmass drifted away from its home in the tropics, the crazy formations carved by eons of erosion that during your stay become like old friends you almost want to wave to as you pass by. And then Black Mesa itself, which rears up out of the flatlands like a gigantic earthen whale breaching. And then there's the wildlife that springs up everywhere and anywhere. I just adore this place, but I've never been to the top of the Mesa. My husband, video photographer Chris Cook, has on a previous trip for Discover Oklahoma. With our youngest, Gus, now 13 and practicing up for a 50-mile scout backpacking trip, it seems like the perfect time for a bucket list journey to the top of our state. We're traveling in May, generally the perfect time, cool in the mornings, warm in the afternoons. This year there's been plenty of rain, but the cactus haven't yet hit full bloom. Still the occasional yellow of prickly pear pops. The walk from the trailhead to the summit is 4.2 miles, and most of it's a pretty easy journey. But remember, it's a lot drier up here than in the rest of the state, so bring plenty of water and wear layers because it heats up and cools down pretty quickly. There's a big green arrow, so we know we're going the right way. Yeah. The Black Mesa Trail is well marked and easy to follow, and there are places to rest and savor the vista as you go. Cool. At one mile, you get a bench. Woo! And a really great photo op. The second mile is a lot like the first, but then you start to climb. This is where it gets a little tougher, so keep this in mind if you want to do this hike. That's where we're headed. We're going to go up this little hill here and zigzag around there and end up on the Mesa. You ready? Yes. Okay. How's the pack feeling? Feels good. good. All right. Here we go. Most important, take your time. Watch your step over the rocks and be sure to allow yourself a few lovely unhurried moments <laughs> to stop and look around. Wow, that's gorgeous. <laughs> You never know what you might see, quietly enjoying the mesa right along with you. Three miles now and another bench and another gorgeous view. Here we are, mile three. Yep. <laughs> Finally, the last push to the top of the mesa. This is the steepest part of the trail, but you know the payoff is just ahead. Close now. Heavy breathing. Mom, at the top. That is, well, it's all worth it. <laughs> that is gorgeous. That is a great view. Truthfully, what amazes us the most up here is how big the Mesa is, 28 miles long, about the distance from Oklahoma City's Devon Tower to Memorial Stadium down in Norman. I don't think you realize how big it is to, not just tall, but how, there's a whole world just up here. It's so big you forget you're on top of something, and there's another full mile to the summit. This thing, you don't even realize you're up on it. It's so giant till you look behind. At last, the obelisk marking the highest point in Oklahoma, 4,973 feet. If my own feet will just get me there. Oh, there it is. Yep, we're here. <laughs> what does it say? Oh. Okay. <laughs> be bad to break your ankle this close to the to the end wow we're here <laughs> the view is amazing you can see it mountains is. over there mountains there and see three states from here but don't finish your trip here it's just about a quarter of a mile straight south to the far edge of the mesa overlooking kenton oklahoma a great place to sit for a spell before you head back down you've been to the top of oklahoma now what'd you think Really cool, great view. I, it was really fun, I liked it.